Hey guys, it's Alice. Welcome back. I have a, this is kind of like a double haul. I want to show you a couple of the items I found at the 99 cent store. It's not a whole lot, but I want to show you what I found because I think they have some pretty amazing things right now. And then I want to show you what I found at the Dollar Tree. So I'm going to start with the 99 cent store. The first thing that I, well not the first thing that I found, but the first thing I'm going to show you. In my store, they have like, I want to say like houseware or like um, home decor type stuff, kind of like um, like um, home home goods or DDs, like what they would have on the back wall. Well, I found this little um, two-tier porcelain dessert stand. I thought it was really cute. I dug through a couple of them, and this is the one that I felt like, okay, this is going to be the one. Um, now, the purpose of buying this wasn't for dessert. I had a craft show a week ago, and it, I thought it'd be a cute idea to kind of display some of my hair accessories and little smaller bows, like, on these little plates. And it, it, it came out pretty cute. My only issue with this, I mean, $2.99 isn't a bad deal. The bottom part stayed pretty well. But this top part, I cannot, for the life of me, get it to stay in. It does not want to. So I hot glued it excuse me whoa I hot glued it the bottom part stayed in but the top part still doesn't want to work so I'm gonna have to go back and I don't know maybe use some like gorilla glue or some super glue and try to figure out how to get this sucker to stay in I do not plan on taking it apart so once it's glued I'm just gonna make sure it stays glued and then I just you know keep it in a safe place because I already kind of glued this bottom part and you can see all this glue that I have here and it still didn't hold up um this part stayed in so it does come with you know the hardware and then the two plates so it was really cute but for $2.99 I just feel like I kind of got gypped a little bit like come on 99 cent they're trying to step up your game at least make your items work whatever I'm still gonna keep it I just have to mess with it and work with it Another thing that I found, and it was my birthday weekend, so I thought, I'm going to treat myself to something cute. And one thing that I love to make for myself, and sometimes the kids will drink it, um, sometimes they don't, but mainly in the spring and the summertime, but still drink it throughout the year. But what I like to drink is infused water, and they had these really beautiful canisters, and these were $5.99. Now, I did go through all of them to test out the nozzle here so you open it so you open it like that and then it just turns this way to to close and it's like this um rose gold you can't really tell on camera but it's like this rose gold type of gold it's really pretty now they had this design and they had another like a kind of like a honeycomb design but i thought this one was really pretty so i thought i'm gonna treat myself and get me this pretty glass container and put it in my kitchen for my infused water because I do I'll put them in like little water bottles but then sometimes it's empty and then I want more so I thought this would be fun to put in my fridge with some mint and some strawberries and some chai seeds and whatever I like to throw in there lemon and all the good stuff that I like to make with my infused water so that was a little birthday treat to myself another item that I found for myself and I'm to go with the kitchen because it's, you know, it has that pretty bronzy color, that pretty bronzy goldish rose gold. This is um, just a little mason jar and this was 99 cents. I thought this was really pretty and I'm just going to put this on my sink with some hand soap. Um, or I might, yeah, no, I'll put hand soap. I might go back and get another one so that I can put one with dish soap and one with hand soap and then maybe put some like pretty labels on the front. So that the, I could have like a matching set. But this was only 99 cents. So I thought this was really pretty. I'm going to put that in the kitchen. And then this is for the boy. He's kind of in the next room. And I don't want him to hear me. But this is for Peter. I thought it was cool. It comes with this green guy. Whatever it is. And then that. I don't want to say it out loud. And then the little thing right there. And this was only 5 bucks. So not bad gonna start my Christmas shopping and I, and I love getting toys and goodies from 99 cents store last year I got a lot of stuff from 99 cents store a lot of Christmas presents so that was pretty awesome and I I mean budget wise it worked out so well for me so this is everything that you see that it comes with and they had a couple other ones they had I think two other ones but this is the one that I chose to get a couple more like I said I don't have a whole lot of items 
to show you, but um, let me just get out what I did find. I picked up two of these because I needed one for the bathroom, and I think I'm going to put one in my daughter's um, stocking. Now, you can see here it says $4.95 value. So wherever this came from, they were selling it for almost $5. That's like a dollar a piece for each of these items. It comes with a nail clipper, cuticle stick, tweezers, toenail clippers, emery board, and um, oh yeah, all five of those items. <coughs> Excuse me. So I did get two, one for the bathroom, and then I'm going to put one in my daughter's stocking because she's been like really into her nails lately and just keeping her nails and toes manicured. So that is really cool for a stocking stuffer. And then for more stocking stuffers, this is the designer nail file three-piece set. There's this one, this design for one of my daughters, and then this other design for my other daughter. I thought those were really cute. Really cute. They look like the packaging is really pretty, too. So those are just a couple stocking stuffers that I found. And then I picked these up. I thought they were super adorable. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep them, if I'm going to make like a gift basket. I am i don't know if I'm going to give them to my sister because I know she likes mimosas. Let me just show you what they are. They're these plastic mimosa or these little plastic um, drinking glasses. Mornings are for mimosas and stop and smell the rosé. Now this one I thought was really cute. At Target they had, I was walking by the Christmas stuff and then next to the Christmas aisle they have the wine aisle. <laughs> Yeah, go figure. Um, but they had a wine bottle that said, um, you know that phrase, no way, Jose? Well, they had a wine bottle that said, yes way, Rose. And I thought, oh, that is a cute phrase. Now, I thought of getting that wine bottle and pairing it up with this, a uh, couple of these glasses, and then maybe like some chocolate or just some little desserts. And that could be like a really cute um, Christmas gift for somebody. So that's an idea. And then also... This little cup, mornings are for mimosas. And then they had a couple other colors that were that did have any writings on them. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this one yet, but um, I just thought it was really cute. Um, my daughter likes to drink wine. She's 21. She's going to be 22 in a couple of days. And she, she really enjoys drinking wine with her dinner and just whenever. But, so I don't know what I'm going to do with those yet. But I really want to get that bottle of wine, Yes Way Rosé, and pair it with that rosé um, glass. I just thought it was really cute. Well, the reason that I had went to the 99 cent store was for Amaris's birthday. I wanted to pick up a few items because um, I needed a few more things. And I didn't like what the Dollar Tree had to offer. I did pick up a couple of items. I picked up this bag, but it turns out I didn't really need it after all. But I'm just going to save it um, for whoever's birthday comes up next. Um, I picked up this tassel. And when I bought it, I didn't know that you had to like actually make it. It came with the, the twine or the string for it. And then you just get this, you open it up, you, you scrunch, scrunch it, and then you fold it over the twine and then squeeze it. So it looks just like this. So really cool. And it does come with, um, let me see, I still have it up as a matter of fact. Four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I think it came with 12 of the tassels. Um, so that was pretty cute. And she, my daughter does not. Amaris hates pink. So I just put up the blue, the green, and the purple. But she absolutely hates pink. So I'm going to put these ones up. And I just left my decorations up because my daughter, my oldest daughter's birthday is in a couple of days. So I can reuse the decorations that I already have up and just add the pink. Because she and I absolutely love pink. So we're going to put the pink up for her. And then the last item that I got at the 99 cent store actually two items but I'm not going to show you the last one because they're just these giant metallic glitters that I bought for decoration and the cat was eating them and throwing up so I had to we had to scramble and find them all in the house throw them away as fast as we could because he was like throwing up all over it was just a mess but this was really cool I thought this was super cool so you know how sometimes you buy balloons and you're like crap I don't have a helium machine and I don't I just have to throw these balloons around the house so I thought this was really cool. You, they're just balloon sticks and they come with this little thing. And this is what it does. You just blow up the balloon, you tie it off and you pop it in the little thingy and it holds on the stick. So super easy. And for 99 cents, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And there was a couple in the room. So I believe it's a 10 piece and it says balloon holder, 16 inch. 
This is the brand. It's a party. They have a lot of really, really, really amazing items at the 99 cent store. So if you guys need party stuff, 99 is your place. Now I'm going to put this stuff out of the way. And then I'm going to go ahead and show you the items that I found at um, the Dollar Tree yesterday. I went for a couple of items and walked out with more than I should have bought, but whatever. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what I got. So let me just go ahead and put this stuff away, okay? I'll be right back. Okay, so now I can get into my Dollar Tree haul. I got some stockings here. And I got just one bag full of lots of goodies that we found the other day. And some of them are stocking stuffers, so I'm going to go ahead and show you what I got. And I'm going to kind of lower my voice a little bit, because I feel like I'm talking really loud and the kids are in the other room. So, let's start with the stockings. We needed new stockings. I haven't bought new stockings in a long time. All my stockings are from Dollar Tree, but I just feel like they're so old and kind of like, eh. We decided to go ahead and get new stockings. So, Amaris is Star Wars obsessed. What did I say Star Wars for? She was Star Wars obsessed last year. This is not Star Wars. This is Spider-Man. Get it right, girl. She is Spider-Man obsessed. So she picked the Spider-Man stocking, of course. Isabel, my oldest, is Frozen obsessed. So I got her the Frozen stocking. That one's cute. Lissette picked the Cheetah. Peter wasn't with us, so I went ahead and picked this one for him. I thought it was cute. Now, if he doesn't like this, I'm not going to take the tag off until he decides if he likes it or not. Um... Oh, just kidding. doesn't even have the tag. Well, I'm sure they'll still let me exchange it as long as I don't take this out. Um, but if he doesn't like it, then I'll take him to go get a different one. But I'm hoping he does. And then I just got this one for my husband. Because, I mean, it's just a plain stocking. He's not into all the decorations. I already had myself a stocking. And I'll insert a photo of it later at the end of the video. That I bought for myself last year at the 99 cent store. And it's a pink stocking with Minnie Mouse on it. So... That one is mine. Okay, I have a little mini tree in my kitchen that is a Starbucks tree. And I thought it would be cute to kind of add some extra little bubbles on them. I'm not really feeling the gold ones, but I feel like the gold and white will just match like okay. I don't know, maybe I'll just put the white ones on there. I'm going to skip out on the gold ones. But I like the little white ones. Not Christmas related, but the kids needed more craft paper. And, come on, Dollar Tree. Is it just me, or are they getting skimpy with their packs? Look at how small this arts and crafts paper is. 36 sheets? Are you kidding me? I mean, I could just go to Walmart and buy a big stack for like 4 bucks. If you're going to be this cheap, Dollar Tree. Like, seriously. I want my money to stretch, okay? Simba's here. Hi, Simba. Making a ruckus, and I bought Simba a new toy. Let's see how he reacts. He loves this one. He has one. He has this one already in orange, but or not orange, but red. In red. There he goes. I'm gonna take it off if I can do this with one hand. He's already freaking out. I'm gonna go ahead and give that to him right now because this is for him. And let's just sit here and admire mi gato for a minute. Let's see if I can get it away from him and throw it on the floor so him so he can play with it over there. Okay, go. Go over there. You're in my way. Nothing fancy, but I ran out of garbage bags. Oh, not garbage bags. Sandwich bags. I seen these the last time I went in, and I didn't get them. But this time, I'm like, hmm. I'll try them out. Let's, Amaris picked these. These are the hot cocoa. You get six um, hot cocoa candy canes. And I wanted these. I don't know why, but I just felt like I really wanted them. And you get lemon head. Six lemon head candy canes. Like, I feel like I'm huffing and puffing right now. Like, I can't breathe. Okay, I bought Simba some more food. This one was new. This is the Meaty Bites Ocean Fish and Sauce. Now, I've never paid attention to their sizes. But, apparently, I've been buying the three, the 13 ounces. So, I looked closely, and I'm like, hey, these look bigger. And I checked them all out, and... I picked all the ones that were 13.5. So there's two different. They're all friskies. But they're two different styles of food. These are like the meaty bites. Yeah these are meaty bites. And the other ones are pate. So the 13 ounce are pate. And these are the meaty bites. So it just has like little chunks of food. And these are 13.5 ounces. So I got him four of the chicken dinner and gravy. And four of the 
ocean fish and sauce. And he really loves his cat food as well as the dog's dry food, yes. He will climb into their dog food and he will eat it. Cannot be without our brownies, so after dinner I'll probably ask Lisette to make these because she's the baker in the house. Picked up some more Suavitel because I ran out and another bottle or two more bottles of the Dayquil because we go through this like hot cakes around here. And I'm just going to dump all of this on my bed and start with, let's see. Simba got a hold of one of these the other day. I was playing with it on the floor. I made the mistake of leaving it on my dresser. And he was playing with it on the floor. And when I went to pick it up, it had little bite marks all over it. So I threw that in the trash. Bought me two new ones to have. I also bought me some hair ties because I needed some really bad. I didn't realize that I was all out. And then I needed some nail files as well. So I bought me those. I thought this headband was really cute. It's like a denim style headband. And it has this stretch right here. It's the thick band. So I got that. And that's by the Basic Solutions. Oh, I also bought me that white sanding block and some more nail glue. Alright. Um. Oh, I bought these for work and I forgot them. <laughs> so those... I got for me for work nothing fancy mm, I bought these for my daughter for her stocking these are the LA colors loose face and body shimmer this one is magical dust so it's like a I don't know like a pinkish orange and then also the fairy dust that one's like a pinky color this one's more like a bronzy or orangey color, or coral. There we go. That's what I can correlate it to. Haha, <laughs> you like my cheesy jokes? I wanted to try this. This is the Compact Makeup in Light Medium. This is by Color Mates. The Creamy Beige. This is the LA Colors Liquid Makeup. Liquid Makeup, Flawless Looking Skin in Creamy Beige. So this is also foundation. And then I wasn't sure if I had this one or not. But I like to have, I like to get these every once in a while and just kind of put them in my stockpile because I love the LA Colors blush. This is the Powder Blush Velvety Finish in Spice. I really love this color. I picked these up for my daughter, Lisa, as well as these cute little, did I get her, the, oh no, I didn't get her the hair ties. I got her these. I just thought these would be cute in her hair. She likes to do all kinds of little things to her hair. I'll probably go back and get her more because they also had these. And Amaris picked these because she likes to put these on while she's washing her hair. And then I picked these for me just because I thought they were cute. And I think I can wear these around the house like when I'm cleaning or just when I go to sleep. And then the last item that I wanted to show you is I found these at the register. And I picked three. These are the small thin flashlights. And they work really well. So let me just try to push this. You can see how bright that is. So I got one in the rose gold and two in silver. And they had one more in black, but I didn't like the black one. So I'm going to keep one of these in my purse. Put one in the car. And maybe give one to the girls. I don't know, but I want to go back and get more. These are really cool to keep in, like, even emergency stuff. So that's it for my small little Dollar Tree slash 99 cent store haul. You guys have a... And that's it for my Dollar Tree slash 99 cents for hostel. Hope you guys had be have a beautiful blessed day. Sorry, I had to stop the last, um, I had to stop the video. But anyways, hope you guys have a beautiful blessed day. And I will see you on the next haul, you guys. Stay blessed. Love you guys. Bye.